We are back now hanging out in the CI kitchen to share a few brunch menu items. It's Bergie's Place in Monticello, Pete Bergstrom, owner. What are you whipping out of the oven yeah, over there? You guys need to this fill me in. What is here. this? This is amazing. What is it? It's a German pancake, which is made with a lot of egg, pastry flour, a little bit of vanilla. Wow. And, and it's so, it was like so poofy and it looks like a little pizza. Yeah. So is this a breakfast item or is it dinner? Or both. Or uh, any time. I eat breakfast for dinner. I don't <laughs> yeah. know about you guys. Well, it's yeah. Very, very easy. Liner. Liner. <laughs> and is the sugar on top? This is cinnamon sugar. Mm. Or we do powdered sugar, blueberries a lot, and then a squeeze of lemon makes a whole bunch of difference on top of this pancake. Okay, really? you're blowing my mind right there because right when you were sprinkling that sugar, I was thinking like elephant ear, funnel cake, and then you spruce on the lemon. I'm like, whoa. That it, takes it to a whole nother level. It goes with the butter and the kind of cuts into the fat, and it just it's a totally different pancake when you Ooh. put the lemon on now, top of it. Now, obviously, this is something I want to come see you for because you're sure. the expert here. But it's, pancakes are normally simple ingredients. Can I do something like this at home? <laughs> like, what's in it? It's uh, pastry flour, sugar, vanilla, milk, and egg. That That's sounds pretty simple. simple. It's very, very Can simple. you remind Erin, since she's just now joining us, what we made earlier with that egg concoction? Yeah, this is our sunlight scramble. It's got asparagus, red onion, and quinoa in three scrambled eggs. It's kind of our gluten-free version for some option because we put a salad with it with a nice apple. Okay. And the right salad is kind of the Asian inspiration <laughs> that you right. got. Exactly, because I used to travel to Asia a lot, and we can always have vegetables were a big part of their breakfast over there. And so I kind of got used to. I didn't. I didn't yeah. You should be more like that, though. Okay, and that bacon is like but, the thickest bacon ever. Yeah, this is our bacon. Oh. It's, it's Niemeyer bacon out of Wisconsin, and we buy it in an entire entire slab, and we just hand slice it ourselves. Okay. So you get kind of a bacon steak. Our biscuits oh, that we make in house. Oh. <laughs> Heather might have already asked, are you guys okay with the pandemic hanging in there? We're doing much, much better. Okay. I, the people are really helping us out. We did great on takeout, and we had outdoor parking, and or our parklets when we had outdoor seating and stuff like that. We're doing a remodel now to get ready for when the cold weather shows up and we can't seat anybody outside. Awesome. We'll so, connect you at CILiving.tv.